Hello, my name is Ron. I'm from Molex, and we're just going to cover the Ethernet I/O block today, the TCDEI 8YYX BYU block. So initially when we're uh, connecting, uh, we need to, just in, in the web browser, uh, we need to just type the IP address of the block in the web browser, and in this case, uh, our block is at 192.168.1.17. Uh, when you first come in, in this case I was already logged into the block earlier, but you'll see a uh, password screen, which the password is admin, admin, so uh, username, password, admin, admin. Now that we're in here, uh, we jump to the first page of the block, and it shows the IP address. So some of the just the general statistics or you know, information about the block, uh, part number as well. So that's one way of confirming exactly what block you have, uh, the firmware version in that block, uh, which is sometimes is necessary for support purposes to uh, provide us with that version. The uh, the next page is password setup. So. As I mentioned, the, by default, the password is admin, admin, uh, but you can actually set the uh, password to something different if you would like. So IP configuration. You can also change the IP address through the uh, uh, web interface here as well. So you've got your IP address, subnet mask, gateway. Uh, you can also set it to DHCP, DHCP if you would like. Um, boot P client or uh, factory default of 192.168.1.1 uh, and then once you've done it, just say hit apply. Uh, the boot P client and DHCP client are, uh, if you're using the Ethernet IP version, which in this case this one is, uh, Rockwell provides through their software a free boot P DHCP server when you install the software. 